Hello and welcome to a new video about how to control my controller. <laughs> how to input or uh, how, how to make a controller for my heating element down there. Huh? Last time we finally got the LCD display to work and the, and the input panel. And today I want to use those two things to display some parameters. So uh, to, 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 to change between operational pages yeah, or a menu or however you want to call it. Yeah, I want to have a main page, I want to have a page where I can read all the temperature or the sensors, I want to have a page where I can enter some parameters for the PID or something like this. So I want to have different pages. So I need somehow something to handle this. Yeah. So I'm going to extend now my program. I will make again a new header file, a uh, uh, new element. I will call it a header file and I will call them a uh, menu, menu items, menu items. So I'm going to define now menus. Huh? I simply give it Give each page a number. Define menu main. Main menu. Main menu shall be zero. Then what else have I said? Uh, parameters. This is one. Uh, and then I will define uh, Menu temperatures temp two. Okay, this thing will grow over time. I'm pretty sure. Uh, this is why I use the separate thing, and I'm going to include this here now. Include menu items dot h. Good. And now, here in loop, I have this key and I'm going to make a separate function, handle key, okay? Handle key event. And here, what was the key? Was this an character. Hmm, this is maybe also not a good idea. I will not make this a character. I will make this a byte. Yeah. And I will define here the buttons or the keys. Define key one shall be one. Yeah. Define key norm. No key pressed is zero. Yeah. This is good. One. Then we have key zero. I cannot use zero, so I will use ten. Then what else we have? A, B, C, D. Okay. A. It's unfortunately not text now. B, C, D. I give every key a code. And this is what is happening here. Yeah. Then what else do we have? We have this star. Asterix. ST. Star. For me, it's a star. <laughs> star. What else would be on my keyboard? Huh? Then we have this hashtag. 16. Okay, so these are my keys. And I'm going to use this here, this array. I will use the keys. Ooh, this was wrong. Two, three. And here we have the 
good. Now it's not the it's not the key. Now it's the key code. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is a byte key code. Good. And here, this is also returning a byte now. This is a byte. It's key none. This should work. This should work. Let's try it. Mm -hmm. So this should be code number one. Oof. At least something is is pointed out. Ah, I okay. I cannot just output a byte. Uh, it's interpreted as code. Uh, but I will then again put this here on my serial as well. Let's see if this worked. Hello, Heinz. I forgot to... Uh, ah, happening, right? This is the recording, why not? See, it's working. <laughs> and also it's working here. Uh, five. No, we are nice. But... 90. Look, <laughs> I would have to clear this. Ah, oh, yeah. Okay. This is not that severe, yeah, because this is just an informational output. So it's working. What I would have to do now is to call this handle key event. Okay. And I will simply use exactly this there. key code remove this here because I don't want to have this written and I will call this simply like that handle key event get key Then I can remove this. Yeah. This transfer out I will do anytime. Okay. And here I have to check. Here I have to work with the key code. And the same key code might do in different menus different things. So I will first I will first switch. Uh, hmm, I need to know where in which type of in which menu I am. Uh, so 
this menu, I will make a global variable. I will make a global variable. Uh, byte. Menu. Position. Equals. And at the beginning, I'm in the main, main menu. This is good. Uh, and I will select switch main uh, menu, menu position. And then in case I am in menu main, I will do something. In case I am in menu parameters, I will do something. And in case I am in menu temp sensors, I will do something. Okay. In, in case I am in menu main, I will switch according to the key code. And now I make this easy for us. Case key. I will simply use key number A. To switch between the menus okay like this switch to next menu uh, case a uh, menu position equals and the next one should be parameters all right This I will do everywhere. But of course here from parameters I will switch to temp. And from temp I will switch to main so that we have a nice circle. And now I only need to I only need to only put something out, uh, write something out. So I will write here output main and here I will write lcd dot uh, set cursor zero zero. I will simply delete for the beginning I will just delete the main line on 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Let's hope this is correct. Yeah. And then I will print something. Yeah. And I will write, I will write simply main. main page. For whatever this is worth, I will also do a void output main, I will also do parameters. And I will do temp. Temperatures. This is good. So we'll also call this here. If we change to parameters, I will output parameters. If we change to temperature, this is was wrong. I will output temperatures. And if we change to main, I will output main. Why not? Huh? And in, in setup at the end, I will also output main because at the beginning I'm at, I'm at the main page. And now I should be able 
to change between to change between the, the, the main pages with the button A. Uh, upload. Let's see. Main page, okay. Parameters, temperatures. Main page, parameters, temperatures. Main page, parameters, temperatures. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Good. I'm satisfied. So we can change now between menus. Huh? This is how this might work. Huh? State machine change according to keys and change the page and store it in some in some position yeah next time we are going what can we do read temperatures already why not uh, next time we are reading in temperature sensors for um, our next time we are using I'm going to use here these uh, Dallas temperatures uh, sensors with the one wire pass. I will explain next time. Next time, reading in the necessary temperatures, I will just apply those there. Okay. For this time, thank you very much for listening. And goodbye.